<clears throat> this is just going over how um, I'm MacGyvering or rigging this setup. This spool here is a 20 foot, or 20 foot high. And so it weighs close to, I'm guessing, 80 to 100 pounds. So it's a juggling act getting that thing up there. I was up there once already holding it in my arms. I got it all the way up. But in order to uh, handle it with that slippery plastic on and get it in behind this one that I put in already, which I should have put in afterwards, but uh, we had a change of plans. The smaller rolls the customer wants on the bottom. Originally, I had it up in the, in the on the top there in the very back so I could put them in sequentially. So I put it on that one and it gives another six inches of drop uh, length to the floor. <clears throat> Anyways, I got to get this big guy up over there. So what I've done here is I taped up this loose cord on the end so that it could be snug to the roll. And what I'm going to do, I rigged up this uh tie down to make a loop hanging off of the old bracket system i installed and i'm going to put the motor end through here rest it on there and then put that in and in over there it's going to be a challenge <laughs> to say the least um i think i'm gonna have to actually set up another one over there to uh, hold the weight because it to go all the way down to the floor with it uh, slippery plastic that's not gonna work I don't think and because it's 10 feet long I can't um, you know get go over there in order to position it into that hole without it being supported up there. So what I gotta do is I gotta set up two of these hoops here. Thankfully, these this system is longer, so I can support it off that old bracket. And I'll put a bit, I'll put the camera down so I can be filmed doing this. Okay, so here we go. I got it taped on the ends. I've got some hoops up there to take the weight on that side and this side. I got the strap draped over the roll just to hold the, the hoop out a bit. So this is saving the customer money if I can do it myself because to have another guy out here, say 20 bucks an hour is what I would want to pay at least. Um, is a lot more money. Turn this flash off. Okay, hopefully I got this set up right here. Away we go. Just be like the strong man competition and grab that bar with aggressive this. So 
sometimes I over exaggerate, it might only be seven pounds. But it's their story if it's a hundred pounds. <laughs> find out the spec sheet from the supplier later what it actually is so what I need to do Take your time and do it slow. It's a key thing. So I got that one now. Thank the Lord. Feel it as you put weight on it. Okay, so I don't think that's going anywhere. Neither is that. So the first step is to get this end in over here. So that ends on the plastic still, so it's a little slippery. Screw it in. Wiggle it in there. Now, hopefully, this guy's not in the way. I think it is actually. Son of a gun. than taking this guy down. Um, if I lift that guy up, this is where I need two guys. Get that up higher. I want to just take this whole thing down. That's probably what I should do.
Just be careful. So I gotta take the cotter pins out on each end. lighter so Garage is full of garage stuff. <laughs> I'll probably do like that handyman on YouTube. Where he puts his videos in high speed and he talks woo, 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 like Mickey Mouse. <laughs> okay, now I can get this guy in. Theoretically. Don't try this at home. Not responsible for what happens at your home. was short of cotter pins I put it in a paper envelope and uh, at least I think that's what they did and that envelope was ripped open by who knows who but I got some uh, 12 gauge wire here to slip in where the cotter pins are supposed to go to hold it falling out. Gotta get it through the hole that is. There that ends secure. I'm hoping that the uh, other side is not going to be so hard to install. Pardon me, I'm hoping the other 20 footer is not going to be so hard to install. You gotta know how to use ladders to do this, that's for sure. Thank you, 
you, Jesus. <sighs> and that's taking his name in honor, not in vain. Got it, man. Woo. <sighs> so I'll show you up close. Psalm 23 handyman, workmanship. So you can see the dowel's too long, and there's my little clip that I used. Just a piece of wire, 12 gauge wire. <clears throat> Same on this side, 12 gauge wire. It looks like the dowel's good on this end. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do about that. If I'll, I might cut it off on the other side. Or both sides, actually. All right. Pitter-patter. Let's get at her. <sighs> 